maybe seen in men. Verily I say to you, they had a reward. Like you go to the church, stand up, pray. Let's all pray. They pray. They do this thing called uh, liturgy. They have this long, drawn-out ceremony. They're wearing uh, crazy garments. Well, we got the Bible says to wear this, but the French, they don't wear that. They, they came up with their own thing that was not in the Bible. So they do this long, drawn-out, boring ceremony that the Lord said don't do because they love me praying, standing in the synagogues, which is the modern-day church. The synagogue means house. Well, what I say right here? And when thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are, for they love to pray standing in the synagogues in the corners of the streets, that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. But when, but thou... When thou prayest, enter into thy closet, and when thou hast shut the door, pray to thy father which is in secret, and thy father which seeth in secret shall reward thee openly. Oh, here go another one. But when ye pray, use not vain repetition as the heathens do, for they think they shall be heard for their much speech. Oh, that's going to the, uh, the Muslims. So that's like the Muslims. Five times a day, got everybody break down, pray at the same time. Do you read, um, um, I study everything. Yeah. One thing that I really didn't get into is the Quran. Like, yeah, I'm a follower of Jesus Christ. You know what I mean, but like, I ain't really get too deep into the Quran though. But I, I studied a little bit of the Moors, um, uh, Bible, all that. Like, I read, I read like Prophet Slam. I study politics all that. Like, so I read. But we study, we study a lot too. I study. Quran. I mean, I studied the Quran and found some disturbing things in the Quran. I did. <laughs> it's, I forget the. Uh, it's been a minute, but uh, we can look it up. You got Google. You can, there's scriptures in it. It says it's okay to have sex with little boys. Like in the Quran, there's another one uh, that says don't make uh, Christians your friend. Yeah. Bible says. Yeah, he did marry a nine-year-old. Yeah, he was having sex with her too. Just real quick. So, do you believe that that um? Are you? Are you on a hit to the five percenters? Seven hours. We we just got that's the news we got. Uh, the bank went three weeks ago. See, oh, no, when the brothers came down? Yeah. Now look, now, now, now. I believe some of their teachings are far as coming in so No, can't okay, no man. That's the only thing they got right. What? That we're gods. We are God? Why is that? But where did they get that, no, though? God chose them. They, they, they got that from the Bible. Look, we're going to get it. That's in the Bible. Watch. John 10 and 34. He said, I commanded these 12, go and say, go you to the lost, you to the house of Israel, teach them that the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Uh, read that. John 10 and 34. Now I was shy, asking them, is, is it not written in your law? I said, you are God. He called them God, and to whom the word of God came, the scripture cannot be broken. The scripture cannot be broken. That a lot of people got problems, but we're not saying we the creator of the most high. But the most high, we're, we're the sons of God. So if the Most High had children, and He's God, and we're a little baby God, right? That makes sense. We're made after Him, His image. You know what I mean? But you off, but you need. Oh, don't go too deep. Don't go too deep. I'm conscious. All right. All right. Okay. We hit it with it. That's all I do is build. Can you hear? You know. You know. Sometimes you just gotta go a little bit at a time. You know. You talking to a conscious brother, man? Look it up. Uh, you look up the word Genesis 1 and 1. 
In the, be, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. You look it up in Hebrew, in the Old Testament, in Hebrew, right? So it actually says, in the beginning, God's created the heavens and earth. And it actually says, and it actually says, and it actually says, well, I got, you know, it actually says, and it, uh, God said, let us make man after our image, after our likeness. Because that's the, that's the, the angel. Okay, now. Yeah, I was trying to angel. That being said, are you are you are you hip to some of the lost books of the Bible? Well, well you got some right here. You got please some? just read. Okay, okay, okay. Please, we're just reading out the apocrypha. That was in your please, yeah, yeah. Man, but that's the apocrypha yeah. though. That yeah. other stuff like uh, we don't be dealing with no I'm Enoch. We don't mess with no Enoch and no uh. None of that. Uh, There's a stuff that right here. This was that was in the set too. I need to get this. That was in the ancient too. The ancient yeah. yeah. like no. Enoch was never in the scripture. That was never part of the canon. But that was part of the canon for thousands of years. Okay, the canon, now what is that? Well, you know, just uh, accepted scripture. Okay. You know, this has always been accepted until uh, by Friday 1800s. A lot of these Protestant churches, they didn't like what was it. There's a lot of prophecies and history in there and stuff. And they had to take it out of the Bible because there's too much truth in it, you know? And I do believe, I do believe that you are, we are it time. Oh, yeah. yeah. Because if you look at everything that's going on in the world, you know what I mean? God is showing us something, you know what I mean? And for me, I have been through some shit, you know what I mean? I lost my sister, my mom. I done lost every woman that's close to me other than the woman I'm with. You know what I mean? Every close woman. Just imagine what I'm losing. Like, you know what I mean? Through that all, you know what I mean? God has been showing me since the young. You know what I mean? I always felt his presence. I know he's getting down with me. I know he wants me to be in his kingdom. And you know that, right? So I say that to say it's like true indeed. They be like, every man that you're talking about is true indeed. They be like, it, it, it's, 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 it's facts. That's why we got to get out here and do it this It can't part. be argued. So, yeah, I like that. It can't, it can't, it can't be argued. It can't. You can't. It can't. You, you can't. You, you, it's facts. It can even go deep down in the you, you can, you can, uh, you can look some of that stuff up, and it's it's recorded. Yeah. You can you can now 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 as far as the science, you can even you can even kind of break it down to science. But this is not to offend, right? Right. Now 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 they say the Israelites, you know what I mean, it's black men. As far as how five percenters look at it, now that's not true. You know what I mean? I do believe that it ain't no color for black and white. Or I'll, I'll give you the uh, skinny on that one. Is, uh, originally, all people were dark skinned. You know, so but what happened? It look Israel. Israel is the most numerous. Say this over and over. Hey, you gotta keep repeating this. Israel is the most numerous people on the earth. We're more numerous than any other people. Like uh, the Lord made a promise to Abraham that I'm gonna make you a seed as numerous as the stars of heaven. And it stands to the sea. Hey, give me that numerous means many, right? Right. So there's more Israelites on earth than any other people, but we got punished and cursed for not following the commandments of the Lord. So we scattered us among all the nations, and we lost our heritage, we lost our identity. We, you know, okay. we, we lost our power. With that, right? Now, again, I'm raising my body, I'm not doing it, I'm conscious. I read a lot. Right. Can't take everything from face value, understand it. Just right. like the Bible says, say something I agree with you say. But it yeah. is. A lot is unknown, that's why we must study. But first, you gotta find out your, 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 the knowledge itself. And through finding it out, you will find it out in the description. Right. Oh, even the scriptures say, uh, judge not according to appearance. But we're gonna show you a, a mystery. This is the original prophecy that Moses gave to the children of Israel. It's about four verses. I gotta go after this one, so right. hit me with something heavy. I right, mean, it, now this is real. This is really this is the main deal, right? That's why the Lord said, "I came not but to the lost sheep in the house of Israel." And Israel's lost, scattered among all nations. That's why, and we'll know who our brother is through the Spirit. We'll know that they Israelite. Go ahead, read that. Nice shirt, man. Nice shirt. Deuteronomy 31, 
weeks I come to pass and went all these days on the Sunday, the blessing and the curse. The blessing and the curse. But part of that blessing, we're going to get the kingdom's going to be the major blessing. But Israel used to have a little blessing under Solomon, King David, you know, who was the top nation on earth, but, the, but it was wicked, so the Lord had to take us out. Keep going. Which I, I said before thee, that shall call them to mind among all the nations where the Yahweh thy God have driven thee. To all the nations, whether the Lord have driven thee. He said, Yahweh, that's the name of the Most High, Yahweh. Keep going. And shall return unto Yahweh thy God, and shall obey his voice according to all that I commanded this day. Thou art thy children with all thine heart, with all thy soul. That then Yahweh thy God will turn thy captives. And he was saying this to the Israelites when they were in the wilderness. So this is a future prophecy. It didn't happen yet. Go ahead. Have compassion upon thee, and they will return and gather thee from all the nations where the Yahweh thy God has scattered thee. Yep, he's going he gonna to gather. That's what we're doing right now. He gathered. Deuteronomy 30. Yeah, that's a, that's a heavy scripture, man. I mean, we, we got hundreds more uh, scriptures that say the same thing. Now that you know, we hear to say that, go read the Bible. Like, read the prophets. Read, read anything. You're going to start seeing how it says Israel was scattered among the heathen as a, as a curse. So that's why we can't always judge by appearance. So basically, so how do you feel about this? Uh, and, 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 to each his own, everybody got their opinions over that. Yeah. Um, and this is not to offend you. You know what I mean, you my brother got me through grace right. flat out. You know? Ain't gonna fit me. You know what I mean, but um, they say that uh, well, well, this I'm not gonna say they. Muslims believe that that um, the original, the original culture of religion. I'm not gonna look at it. It's Islam. Right. You know that's not true. Islam didn't it, come on the scene until 600 AD. Solomon died, Israel broke into two kingdoms, the northern kingdom of Israel, and then the southern kingdom consisted of the tribes of Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, and they called themselves the kingdom of Judah. You know what I mean? So you had Judah and Israel, and then the northern tribe, they got scattered. It was so wicked and evil, they didn't know they, the Lord just scattered them. And a lot of them came over to America, too. The scriptures in the, uh, that second Ezra tells you about how, uh, like the North American Indians are Israelites. And the Bible tells you about how in the book of 2nd Ezra, how they got on a ship and they came over here on ships. You know what I mean? I can see that. So, uh, yeah, originally, the Islam was started by Muhammad. He, was, he, was, he wasn't even an Israelite. He was an Ishmaelite. What's that? An Ishmael was uh, this, uh, Abraham had, Abraham's first son was named Ishmael. Right. Right? But, but he wasn't, the Most High commanded Abraham to have a daughter with Sarah, but he, he, he had uh, sex with a handmaid instead because Sarah couldn't get pregnant. So Ishmael came out and the Lord's like, no, you didn't obey me. So he's not, he's not, he don't get the blessing. So their next child they had was Isaac. And Isaac got the blessing. And Isaac's son was Jacob, whose name was changed to Israel. And they, they got the blessing, not, not Ishmael. So Muhammad was an Ishmaelite. But that was the little Islam thing. That was Ishmael's little blessing. They got to the, have their little kingdoms, their little caliphates. That was, each nation got their little blessing. So How the Lord gave them a blessing. Are you good? How you feel about the Well, the Moors were, it, they were Israelites who got caught up in the uh, Islam religion. You know, but the Moors, you know, they're Israelites. They're Israelites. They're just following Islam. We still got that today. Jake, Jake don't, he want to follow everything, but what he was supposed to. You know what I mean? Jake, you don't want to listen Hey, what's that? Hey, get that, uh, actually, I got it. Let me read one more. One more. I'll go ahead. Go ahead. No problem. Oh, you know Isaiah? Yeah. Oh, that's the spirit. Isaiah 34 and 16. See, he out of the book of the hour, which again, the hour most high. Right, every time you see the word Lord in the Bible in all capital letters, 
That means, because you know the Bible is originally written in Hebrew. So every time you see Lord in all capitals, that means in the original Hebrew text, that's God's name written, which, which is Yahweh, Y-H-W-H. Nope. So false and tell you is Yahweh or Jehovah. But we know it's Yahweh. And his son's name is Yahweh Shah, which is the one they call Jesus. Go ahead. It says, read, no one of these shall fail. Yeah, there ain't no prophecy in here going to fail. Like Mark of the Beast. Mark of the Beast. Oh, don't yeah, all the prophecies was in the Bible. The Bible prophesied about the the, uh, the Babylonians coming into power before they came. Slavery, Israel being scattered. They prophesied about Alexander before he was even born. They prophesied of America. They prophesied about America. Yeah, this is how I see. This is where it's hard going to happen. Right here, this here. is right. This, this, this is because we read. Sound like, 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 uh, what was that city he destroyed? Where he told, uh, what's the name? Uh, Don't look back. Oh, Sodom and Gomorrah, yeah. Like, 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 Because the cross, even the cross as we see it today, it looks like a T. That's called a Norman cross. That didn't get started getting used until like the, the midi uh, late medieval period by the Normans. Even the early cross. All right, you good. Yeah, but that's not really a symbol we use though. It's not actually the real symbol in Israel is the menorah. How do I get in touch with any of you? Uh, you got, hit, you got Twitter. You get on Twitter, Kings of the Earth. Uh, I ain't got a Twitter. Well, Kings of the Earth on Twitter. That's the easy. But you get his number. All these girls can have my number. Maybe a lot of women out here, boy. You like it? Will you go to school or something? Nah. I just got out of prison not too long ago. You never know about how I'm a sister. Oh, yeah? Like, you get one call, shit. About to say, you look like a nice young man. Seriously. Like, I got something. Like I said, I was raised like just made a mistake. I mean, everybody made mistakes. Right. It's hard not to with this pile of shit out here. But you would never know. I made me some mistakes, you know?
Yeah, we gotta do this work. You know, doing this work is important, man. We gotta get out here and teach these people. Yeah, they, they hungry. They hungry. You know, people need the truth. Like you said, you can't deny it. It can't be denied. Downtown Monday, around three o'clock somewhere, maybe three, four, somewhere. It depends. Right. But usually we be out there on Monday, okay. and we be coming out here like whenever. Hey man, you kind of like uh, I know you. I, I know you wasn't gonna say right. Yeah. Man, you kind of look like Kyrie Irving. Hey, he said Kyrie. Kyrie oh, shit. Who was you about to say? Who was you about to say? Oh, Kyrie. 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 Kyrie's a flat earther. Oh, <laughs> he, he believes the earth is flat. I know you heard, have you heard that man this shit? That's some crazy shit. Kyrie, the point guard from Cavs, he just got trained. All right, then, brother. He don't watch sports. All right, brother. All right. We'll take it easy, guys. Hey, see? You don't know who you're going to run? I told you, but you don't know. You don't know. Oh, in the midst of the heat, it's going to be that Jake out here trying to get some pussy. <laughs> I know that's how it always is out here. That one Jake will always come up and talk to us. That's how you do it. 